Okay. There's our buddy. He's doing a lot better. I'm just kidding when he comes around here. Turn back this way. Here he goes. Breathing a lot slower. Moving a lot better. We're just swimming laps now. Are you done yet? You around. You don't stop. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Big Rich from Hot Fish Rescue here. Let you see what all the work we've done over the weekend here. We cleared out the spot for the saltwater tank. We've got all the saltwater supplies over here, which means that all this got cleared out. We gotta put this pump back up. There's the saltwater tank. And then. Let's check in on our sturgeon. Oh. Doing a lot better. Breathing a lot slower. Oh. Look at these guys. They love hiding. I mean, he's in the corner here. They just stacked the top of each other. <laughs> All the cichlids are waiting to get fed. Uh oh, the mirror ball's on. Good morning, guys. See, you look in there and it looks like it's packed full, but here people don't realize there's seven foot from front to back. But looking at it this way, it looks like there's fish on top of fish. Seven foot from front to back. Plenty of room. People don't realize that. How you guys doing? Oh, there's that big peacock bass. He's a monster. There goes some Betty. And let's see this tank here. There's Schwarzenegger. What's up, buddy? Oh, look at you. Aren't you a beautiful, pretty thing? Camera hog. <laughs> and that Sir Heisenberg von Fish Face. You guys ready for breakfast? I like checking them out first thing in the morning. I turn the lights on and see who's doing what. Remember that little guy there? He was having a problem growing. He's starting to grow now. He's doing good as his brother. Oh, look at all the bites you draw crowding together. Y'all cuddling up. Oh, it's your color. It's beautiful. He turned out to be pretty good in this tank. I thought he was a little small, but he's still good. <laughs> you want your air time too, huh? <laughs> this is the black arrow. You guys ready for food? They're gonna hide on me now. You guys are ready for food, huh? You're always ready.
that tap on the side here. Pima comes right out. Look at him. Let me get him some food here. Oh, right, here we go. Once I'm ready. <laughs> How are you doing, Tesla? Oh, you're right up front today, huh? Hi. And the vodka? Oh, you're ready for food, huh? Yes, you are. I usually don't come out here before I feed. I come out here every morning for food, so when they turn on the lights, they're expecting food. Look at those. He got me yesterday. I was showing people how he comes right over to my hand. He bit me. <laughs> these guys. If someone asked if we could go ahead and put these uh, Phantom Red Tails into the 2200, the albino tank, and sure we can. We can thin this out some here. If you were looking for his food. Oh, look at you. Big and beautiful, right up front, huh? Why is this light yellow and all the rest of them are bright white? We're going to have to reconnect it to the... See that? Yellow. Bluish white. Yellow. I have to reconnect it to the Wi-Fi and set it to the right color. Oh, look at the lungfish. Yeah. They're definitely picking on each other. Look at that tail. This is our old one. See how it's got the long arms? And that's the new guy. His arms were bitten off. And his tail chewed up a little too. A royal clown knife back there. Then we got the gold clown knife here, the Xanthic, along with that big old goby. And our turtles, they uh, they decided to make their house big enough for the both of them themselves. They bent the bottom open. <laughs> What's up, guys? So we got them a plastic tray here just to try and keep the sand off of the food. So I put the food on that plastic tray. They eat that and they go in their water. Let's look up here. Look how big you've gotten. Yes. Look at you. You're a little monster, ain't you? So pretty. Let's look over here. And the cichlids. You guys all know it's time to eat, huh? Look at this. <laughs> oh, there's some food in there. Let me stand back. They're all right there. There's nothing in that whole other 1,800 gallons. They're all in this, I don't know, this end about 300 gallons. But now, hopefully you see the babies come out. There are so many babies in here. They're everywhere in there. Look at that. So tiny. Look at all them babies. I love seeing these guys eat. Oh, look at you. You just 
gorgeous, ain't she? Of course, the piranha down there. Then all the new guys. Remember, we got the, the bass in. And we got tilapia in here. Let me see. There's one of the bass back there. Oh, there's an alligator gar. Where's the other bass at? Oh, there's the other bass. No. That's a tilapia. Oh, there's the other bass. The mensis right there. All right, well, let me go in and get some food, and we'll come back out and feed them. Okay, so today we're putting in some blood worms into the little holder for the discus. And then real quick, I'm, I got some... Uh, well, today it's romaine lettuce. Uh, they got a bunch of other stuff up in there, and we got some fruit for them too, but... You guys got some greens? We'll come back in a few minutes, see them eating them, eating them over there. Let's go over here. And we'll feed the angels. We got flake food for them. Oh, there they go. Do a little bit to the discus too. For waiting until the, the uh, blood worms melt. There we go. Now they're eating. Angels are eating. We got these guys up here. Let's go ahead and feed them. And you guys want fed again? I know you do. It was only like 20 minutes ago, I just gave you food. They're soaking, they're getting me soaking wet. Wow. Okay. Let me go find some food for you, buddy, back in the food tray. While I'm passing these guys, let's go ahead and throw them some food. Get this out of here. Here we go. Ouch! Cut my finger on something sticking up up there. They're all eating. Come back behind here and we'll feed the shack koi and the shack koi. Okay, here we go. There's this one. Okay, let's get some more food. Now these guys over here are just absolutely crazy. Let me throw some in here, see if we can get some to look in there. I have to hold my hand over the hole so they don't splash it. Let's see if he eats these. Got a couple in there for you. Oh yeah, you like them, huh? These are these big jumbo sticks. Here you go, buddy. Here's a couple more. I didn't want to throw a bunch in because I didn't know if you'd like it or not. See that cut on my hand? Yep. I'm going to close this lid down. Alrighty. Let's go check on the turtles. Oh yeah, there's a little foot out there tearing it up. See, we just use that plastic plant tray to keep most of the sand off of the food. So we're good there. Now let's get this guy to eat. We've got some sinking massivore pellets. That's what he likes the best. You see him getting ready right there. Get two of those over here for him. 
Okay, here we go. They're right under you, Doopy. There you go. <laughs> Okay, we're going to go ahead and give these guys a little, feed them like normal, and we're going to add in some other food for the new uh, sturgeon. But this is what I normally feed the goldfish, is these sinking pellets. So sturgeon, notice how, how much slower he's breathing and how much better he's doing. We got a little bit of food for the guppies. There we go. Let them eat, these guys eat. Those guys have eaten. Those guys. These guys. All right. What have I missed here? I fed the salt water. Let's go in here and see what else we got here. These guys all get fed at nighttime when Josh comes over. He does the shrimp and the tilapia, cutting up and feeding. Same thing with these guys. Same thing with these guys. This and this. The eel and her and the 2200 all get the shrimp and tilapia feeding. And then we've got the 750 gets that too. Look, all them greens are gone. And they went back in their house. All right. These guys got fed. These guys were fed. Okay, the piranha get the shrimp and tilapia. So does the abonite. So, I, and so does this tank here. So, I fed everything. Oh, you know what? There's these guys back here. They also get the shrimp and tilapia. Him down here and these guys here. So, everything is fed. good deal okay now that's their morning feeding until Josh gets here at nighttime after work he comes over every night and he does a little bit of videoing and then he feeds the uh, shrimp and tilapia so <sighs> let me see we're, we're done feeding for the day well, that's our morning routine now we can go on hey Brutus you want some get a handful for you. He gets a handful every time we walk by. Here you go, buddy. You want some? <laughs> and that signals all the, the cichlids to come over and get what he missed. And I do that every time we walk by. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the little morning feeding. And uh, you know, hit that like button. Share the video if you can. And as always, stay fishy, my friends. <laughs>